Opie and Anthony. We got Mel Gibson voicemails now. Thank God. Can't so, get enough. On February 19th, between 11.30 at night and 3 in the morning, he left eight voicemails. Oh, God. That's a weird... Well, it's not a weird time. That's a bad time, I should say. Yeah. Probably had a few just, belts. <laughs> right, just start I had thinking, a few in him. I need to pick up this phone and Was looking at the calls. phone. Yeah, just staring at the phone. Uh, fucking cunt. I ought to call You know what? I ought to call her. Mm -hmm. She deserves it. And someone actually on Twitter said, will you guys get over the Mel Gibson tapes? They're getting old. How is something getting right, old when you got new stuff coming out? That's from Mel G in L.A. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so listen to something else, you uh, fucking yeah, douche. But explain that to me. Yeah. That, that is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. It's getting old. It's not getting old if the story is still developing. Yeah. If we were still playing tape one ad nauseum, over then, and over then, again. then you would have a point. Don't listen. But this is brand new material. <laughs> Voicemails from Mel Gibson. Starts with this one. It's a quick one. The first one's really quick. What the fuck was that about? He probably wasn't going to call her, and he couldn't ah. help himself. <laughs> ah, 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 ah. I called. He's a grown man. He's Mel Gibson. Well, true. Fuck. Mel Gibson, uh, voicemail okay. number two. Jesus. Edith is not to work at your house. If she does, I'll fire her. I will not pay her for any hours at your house, okay? She only works at my house. All right? I don't want her at your house. I'll fire her. And you know I'll do it. I fire people all the time. And you'll have to find some other fucker. But you have to pay for it yourself. She works at my house. She's my employee. Just thought I'd mention that right now. Now, if you want to call me back, I think we should discuss the terms of separation. Don't you? Don't you think? Yes? Let's do it. I won't smoke either just to fuck with you. I want to really badly, and you would love me to, because you want to destroy me and see me die. And I know subconsciously that your whole fucking aim is to ruin me, but I won't let you. Oh, well. Right? <laughs> you selfish bitch. All right. <laughs> oh, wow. These tapes make you feel like you could be friends with Mel Gibson. Yeah, yeah. And he's just a like, guy going hey, through hang some out. shit. Wow. <laughs> Wow, that smoking thing keeps coming up. Oh, my God. He's having a tough time. There's with the so many problems. But she must have hated his smoking or something. I wonder. But I won't smoke. Maybe she told him he'll go back. You'll go back to it. Yeah. You know, shitty You voice. will go back because you're a weak. <laughs> you are a weak person. I'm not weak. You can't. Voicemail number three. Whore. <laughs> <laughs> Who doesn't love these? He just <laughs> calls up, says whore, and hangs up. Well, that was a couple more seconds. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. But you're almost I right. Thought, you're almost right. That is no, we so had to stop the thing. Whore. <laughs> That's what he said right after beep. Whore. <laughs> whore. Let's answer that fucking phone. <laughs> Whore. Whore. <laughs> I love that. Oh, is he the best? Tape number four, or voicemail four. You were a sour faced bitch today. You think it was tricky to get that fucking tree and the hole and the placenta and organize all that shit? You know how much fucking time and money went into that? Did you thank me? Did you even have a fucking smile on your face? Fuck no! You were down there looking like a spoiled cunt. You don't give a fuck, do you? You really are a shallow bitch. Everything about you stinks. And I'm seeing it real loud and clear. <laughs> fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Everything about you stinks. Everything about you stinks is a great line. What a line. <laughs> Everything That's about perfect. you stinks. I want to know more about the tree plant ceremony. Yeah, what's ceremony? this fucking tree? He's it got comes up a, a few times. A problem with her uh, reaction to this fucking tree. All know. right, Mel, enough with the fucking tree. Some dumb local thing probably, right? Yeah, yeah. She wasn't uh, very festive about it. You no. know how hard it is to put a tree in a hole? <laughs> Voicemail number five. Everything about you stinks. It's <laughs> <That's> great. <laughs> What's that? What's this? Mm. 
<laughs> what was it? Uh, I don't. Why would Iraq? You, what was it? Why are you putting something old here? Iraq. Because you only played it one day. In case you wanted to play it again later. What is it? It's the uh, Mel Gibson Voss remix. Oh well, it doesn't say that, does it? It's, it's, oh, it looked like volume three. It's, it's that's it's supposed to say Voss. All right. Oh no. shit. All oh, right. I All think right. someone deserves an apology. Fuck no. Iraq. Blow me. Apologize. <laughs> Here's voicemail. <laughs> Very good. Voicemail number five. Oh. Uh, just making sure you're awake if you're trying to sleep, because I'm awake. <laughs> and you deserve to be. Yeah. <laughs> he can't slam that phone down hard enough. Uh, he's waking her up because he's well, awake. It says from 11.30 to 3, so what, every... 20 minutes, he can't help himself in yeah. a half hour. help himself. Mm. He's trying to watch TV. He keeps pausing the movie he's watching <laughs> to call this cunt. Voicemail number six. See, you can see I'm not available for use anymore. You can see the wheels dried up, and you just take off. You just leave. You just take off because I'm finished for you, right? Because I can't give anymore, right, to your fucking personal cause. Wow, that sounds like a, a line out of one of his movies. Probably a throwaway That's line. That's your M.O., isn't it, baby? Yeah. Uh, this guy is more on the pl uh, tree planting thing. Kevin. Yeah, man, he planted, he buried the placenta. I can't spit out the placenta with the tree. He says. Oh, like, what, he says placenta? Yes. The baby's placenta, like the, when their yeah, daughter? That's a thing they do. Yes. He said that y when y'all played it just a minute ago, he said the placenta and the tree. Oh. What, 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 uh, which one was that? Fuck, we got to go back. Two? Oh, yeah, oh it, is, is that the, <laughs> the commercials Hulk Hogan's doing? It's for rent the placenta. No, it isn't, Chip. Edith <laughs> <laughs> is not to work at your house. If she does, I'll fire her. I will not pay her. Where the fuck was it? I think it was like Four? two the back. Part, the next one. You were a sour-faced bitch today. You think it was tricky to get that fucking tree and the hole and the placenta and organize all that oh. shit? Oh. You know how much fucking time and money went into that? Did you thank me? Did you even have a fucking smile on your face? Fuck no! You were down there looking like a spoiled cunt. You don't give a fuck, do you? You really are a shallow bitch. Everything about you stinks. And I'm seeing it real loud and clear. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Why would it cost a lot of money? It, it seems like it would be something Everything's to do on your money. property, a little hole, a little tree, a little placenta. Everything yeah, is money with Mel. It's, it's uh, he doesn't if it costs five bucks, yeah. He doesn't want it spent <laughs> on her. Thank you, sir. We didn't uh, pick up on that. Yeah, thank you. Uh no problem, guys. Later. All right, what do you want? Did I play voicemail six? I don't know. See, you can see I'm not available for you. Where you see the wheels dried up yeah. oh. and you just take off. Not. Yeah. Let's go to seven. Have I justified the title mean yet? I think so. Okay, I'll stop being mean now. I'll stop being mean because that's mean. You call me mean, you'll get mean. You call me something I'm not, you'll get it in spades. Remember that and I don't give a fuck whether you ever call me again or not. Well, you kind of do. <laughs> you kind of do. We're up to seven voicemails oh. within a three, four-hour period. Oh. You kind of care. 